Hi, it's Karen at RT Systems. Let's talk today a little bit about the Kenwood TS2000. What a choice in radios. 2 meters, 440, HF, all mode. I think you could do everything on this radio except maybe take it in your little car someplace because it is a pretty good sized model. Let's look real quick at the spreadsheet because I want to show you the settings screens because the settings are a little complicated on this. Being an HF radio, there's a lot that goes on in the background, a lot more than what you're used to with your little mobile radio that you're coming from. So just like in the other programmers, if I put in a repeater frequency, I have offsets, I have FM, I have tones that I can use, I have a name that I can put in. Somebody wanted to do satellite the other day and the frequency was 445.178. Couldn't do it in his little mobile radio that he had because that radio wouldn't do that fineness. But you see this one does. A uh, difference in being an HF radio and being a, a little FM radio. It's still FM because it's in the 440 band. I can set another channel to the input and output that you need one on two meters and you need one on 440. And so I'm going to listen to one on the A band and one on the B band and have the two of them working together. Just use different channels to do it and you're in business for it. That's it in a nutshell. But like I said, I want to get to the settings. Notice all of this. If you put the alternate face on that radio, you have programmable memories that you can switch between, just like you do on the 710 and on the V71, which means you can set up different configurations. Well, if you have the RT Systems program, you can do the same thing, and you can switch between the programmable memories from the software. No need to buy a different head for the radio. Kind of a cool idea. Radio menu settings. These are the global ones. These are the ones that are on no matter which programmable memory you're in, no matter what mode the radio is in. CW settings, FSK settings, TNC settings, Quite a list here. You'll learn more about what they do as you use the radio, as you study about it. Like I said, these HF radios, there's a lot of little tuning and tweaking that goes on so you can get the best signal out and the best signal in. Something about this screen, notice right down here, selected menu A and B. And the screen doesn't appear to change but it goes to the radio differently. The radio has an A and B menu, and you set up A here and B here. Okay? And I told you about the selected PM. It's always in one of them, so it's always in zero. But you can configure the others, and then you can set it up here. And when you send to the radio, it will be working in that configuration. We have some DTMF on this. We have DTMF memories that we can use. And again, we have A and B. So we have two sets of them. Although you don't see the screen change, we have two sets of them. Okay. Let's go to programmable memory zero. This looks very similar, but I promise these are not the same. Menu items are not in both parts of the radio's brain. They are either in the global section, which is what we were just in, or they are in a programmable memory. The ones in the programmable memory, you can set up six different ways, and then it just depends on which programmable memory you're in. You could set one of these up so it's tuned just right for that net that you do every week or just right for the contest that's coming up that you worked last year and you know because it's in the fall you've got to tweak something a little differently or use a different antenna. 
So that's what these are good for. And then it captures it and it's there for next year when you need it. A little bit about the program. When you do communication, send data to radio. You can send the memory channels. You can send the menus and programmable memories or just, the, you know, you set it to none and you're sending just the memory channels. Makes the download a little bit faster. And click OK and it programs the radio and you're up and ready to experiment and have some fun and get on the air. This is Karen, K0RTX. And I'll catch you down the log.